to say this shirt, even though it's not really for like going out or something. It looks great! Hello my fellow Martians and welcome back to my channel and in today's video I will be sharing what I've done for May and my plans for the month of June. So what is up my fellow Martians? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Mama Martian and welcome to the Martian headquarters. Now a lot has happened during the month of May. I honestly don't remember all of them but I specifically remember what I see are the most important things that happened and I'm very very thankful for everything that I have achieved um, within this year. Yes, there were setbacks but I am content and I am happy with where I am right now. And I will also be discussing what are my future plans for the month of June. I would want to do like a quarterly kind of check in with you guys but as I noticed it's better that I do this monthly because I tend to procrastinate along the way of doing my goals. So for the month of May I have five points. Not kidding I have literally five points for the month of May and five points oh six points for June. I'm trying to keep my goals as minimum as possible because I don't want to overwhelm myself with everything. So let's start with May because May is about to end, so I ha I can't just, you know, gloss over May. <laughs> the first thing that I'm very thankful for this month is I received contracts for the Impact of Her Season 1 and I cannot express how thankful I am for all the contracts I've received. It's not a, it's not a lot of contracts, okay? but. For a writer to receive like non-exclusive contracts from online pub publishing sites or like writing sites like Wattpad, that's just, that's just an example. I'm not saying I have contract with Wattpad, but that's just an example. It's every writer's dream, especially when you're a stay-at-home mom and you really want to make writing your career. It's just, it's amazing. It's an amazing feeling and I'm, I've, I'm still over the moon by it. And with all honesty, I am not looking for the contracts. I wasn't looking for them. And as you all know, I went through a horrible, horrible situation last March. And I guess this is God's way of telling me you may have lost something back in March. But I'm going to give you something else. And this will be for the greater good of your future and for Gab's future. So I am very, very thankful with um, the writing opportunities that has been given to me. Next point is I finally, 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 finally started the zero draft process of TSOH, which is the sequel to TIOH. I lost myself. <laughs> I, did, I just took care of Gab. So yeah, I already started uh, TSOH, the zero draft of TSOH last year, but I had to stop because I wanted to focus on TIOH, like I said. And um, now that TIA which is doing well, I had the sense, I don't know, maybe it's every writer, I don't know if every writer has it, but sometimes you have the sense to just say, okay, the book one is done, and you see it doing well, you see it performing well, it's time for you to move to the other book and continue the other chapters. And it's amazing because that's how I am right now. I'm kind of relating this to my life because that's how I see it. A chapter or a book of my life has ended and it's time for me to move to another one, to a new and brighter one. So I guess I guess this year it will be dedicated to TSOH. Just to finishing the whole story of TSOH, then I can do the edits and breaking down of the books and chapters. So yeah. <laughs> another thing that I started this month is I am currently editing the ebook file for the impact of her season one. I haven't finished it yet and I forgot to do it today, but I need to do this video, so I have to make time for it. So yeah, I am currently editing the ebook format. I am not in a rush to do that. I am not in a rush to finishing it actually. I just wanted to make sure that I've started editing that ebook file. Also, if you're hearing my son in the background, Sebastian, his dad's nephew, is currently giving him a bath, giving him a shower. And like I said, we're gonna work around with whatever is going on with my environment. I need to film this video. Next point is I published The Impact of First Season 1 on different publishing sites. I was very nervous to do that at first because I didn't know I didn't know if the audience of a specific writing site will accept it well. But 
I pushed through that fear and I, I was just like never mind never mind the fears let's just post it there and let's just wait and see if people will like it if people will read it you know and I am very happy and glad to see that it is doing well not just with views but people there are people who have left reviews on season one and as a writer that makes your day that really just makes your day because you're here writing and then you're stressing if the story is good if people will like it and you don't know if they will and then suddenly there are people who would leave reviews on your book and they would say it was great it was well written the story was great it just makes all the hours and days and weeks and months and years of working on the book so much worth it and it gives you more push to continue of course i know it will not always be good reviews and i am open to I don't want to say negative reviews. You know, I'm open to criticism, constructive criticism. I'm very open to that. But it just really makes my day to see those reviews. And for those readers, if you're watching this, thank you so much for leaving those, those reviews. And if you have other suggestions or you think there's something else to change, you can always let me know in the comment section there or here on my videos. And number five for me. This is a big, 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 big one for me. That's a lot of big. I released a song. I released a song yesterday. It was out of emotions. <laughs> I was feeling a lot of emotions yesterday and I was like, I'm going to finish this song and I don't care if it's not perfect, I'm just gonna put it out there and that's what I did. Because most of the time I want everything to be so perfect before I put it out and sometimes it does make everything harder for me. So yesterday I made a decision to just write the song, finish the song, rehearse it and just record it. and put it out there and I am very very thankful for the people who watched it or listened to it rather especially the friends that I made since March they have been very very supportive people so I thank everyone for listening to the song I know it's not the perfect version but who knows one day I will be able to do an official version of it like a studio recorded version who knows now that's it from May let's go to June the first goal for June is to finish the impact of her season 2. That's the goal. And I'm actually nearing the end of season 2, which I am very, very surprised. I just want to be able to make sure that season 2 is good to go before I do anything else with season 2. Next point is to submit contracts for season 2. Now, the reason why I say submit contracts is because I'm going to submit season 2 to the other writing sites that have already offered me uh, writing contracts. I'm not going to look for new contracts, you know, I'm just gonna submit to those writing sites who have already offered me the first time, so... Yeah, I'm excited! <laughs> Number three is to continue editing the ebook file for the Impactor for season one. I don't know if I will be able to finish that by June, but if that happens well then great I have a book out by July <laughs> and if it doesn't happen it's fine I'm taking my time with it I don't want to rush into it because the more that I rush into it the more that I stress myself over it so I'm taking one day at a time number four is to post the impact of her season two on different writing sites now I want to make sure that season two is finished on Good Novel because Good Novel is my main writing site. I want to make sure that it's finished there first, give it a little breathing room before I put it on other sites. Because I want, of course, I want the focus to be on Good Novel because that's that's where I originally post the story. And after that, you know, just give it a little bit of time to simmer down and then we post it on different writing sites. You know, just to, you know, you know, just to make sure that everybody gets the best of both worlds. And number five, I didn't know that this is five, not six, but number five, I need to post more creator tube content. I have been away for so long and I haven't posted much creator tube. So I currently have a video here of my gameplay on Mobile Legends that's going to be uploaded. I'm not sure when. And like I said, I have released a song here on my YouTube channel as well. I want to do the traveling writer vlogs again, but this time it's going to be different. It's going to be my journey as a traveling writer 
alone and I am very very excited for that. There's just so many things to do when you when you're a creative person. Just so many things to to share and um, of course, uh, there will be vlogs where it's just me and Gabriel having fun, you know, just shorts of me and Gabriel. And you already see him, you see him on my streams, you see him on my videos, and I don't hide my son from you guys. Um, but I don't really vlog like what we do in a day. I don't do that. Um, who knows? Maybe I will be doing like shorts with my son um, whenever we're out in the park or something like that. But that is all I have for you today, folks. Thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. And let your thoughts be heard in the comment section below. Let me know how May was for you and your plans for June. And did you see the moon? <laughs> I know that rhymes, but have you seen the moon? Have you seen the moon last night? It was so beautiful. <laughs> Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that cute bell on the side to notify each time I post a video. I have an attitude where sometimes I post every day and then I post twice a week and then once and then I disappear for a bit and then I go back to the normal routine. So the bell will really help you know if I am back to life or whatnot. If you want to read the impact of her season 1, all the links are in the description down below as well as my social media platform. So if you want to reach out to me, I have Instagram and I have my email. Mostly Instagram. If you want to reach out to me, I am mostly on Instagram. So send me a DM if you want to be friends. I'm open to new friends. I'm always open to new friends. My friends already know that. So if you want to, you know, like have a chat, you know, and if you're a mommy writer like me as well, send me a message. And if you want to support the channel in other ways, as well as my caffeine addiction, I have a Patreon set up. The link is listed down below. But if you're not on Patreon, I accept any kind of donations to my PayPal, which is also down below. <laughs> Again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys on my next video. Stay safe, stay creative, and happy writing. No Martian.